Good morning, everybody. I hope you had a good Easter weekend. This is actually the day before Easter, but we are going out and spreading a little manure this morning. Actually, this is our last load. Um, I think this is our fifth load we've done this morning. The ground was frozen this morning, so we wanted to get some of the manure on the fields while we still could. Um, and I'll show you where we went. And then, and then we're going to hitch on and take some lumber up to Abby's house, our daughter. Um, and we will show you that also. So let's go. So this beautiful morning, we, this morning we have Ken and Baron on the manure spreader. As you might be able to see, the ground is still frozen, but the sun has come up and it is warming up fast. So I'm glad this is our last load. And at the end of this video, we are going to reveal the winners, and I do mean winners. There was five winners in the weight contest for Lady as she comes along with her pregnancy. Oh. Oh. Cup step. So next on the agenda today, Jim is going to be heading up to Abby's house and we are going to be embarking on a very exciting project. As you can see, Jim has been sawing some lumber and this lumber right here is going up to Abby's house. She's going to be putting a dormer on her fixer upper and Jim is going to be using Bill to take the lumber up. He's got him in the single shafts here and he once again wants to remind everybody how much work can actually be done even if you just have one horse. So 
Abby's house. Abby's house is about uh, not too far from here, but it's a jaunt up the road. And we'll see how he does taking it up there. Jim did spread five loads of manure this morning with Baron and Ken. So this is next on the agenda today. So we're on our way up to Abby's house and Abby's here with me and London. I hope you guys all remember London from last year. If you're new to our channel, he helps us. He helped us out some last spring and he was working towards um, a, a mission trip. And he, where did you go last year, London? Last year I went to Zambia. And where are you going this year? This year I'm going to Bolivia, which is in South America. Okay, so he's along with us. He's been out fixing fence this morning. We got more fence to fix. Later on, we're gonna drop off some posts on the way back, which we've got loaded onto here. In a future video, we're gonna share more. Um, London's gonna share with you about his trip, and um, and I guess that's it for now. It's actually a, a really nice morning. As, a, as we said earlier, Jim was able to spread manure, but things are thawing out and um, it's just a really nice early spring morning. I would say that uh, Bill is not having any problem pulling this lumber since he's trotting up the road. So we just got here and Bill really doesn't look like it was too hard for him. He did really well. Abby's just working on finding out what, where we're supposed to put the lumber from her contractor. So the lumber is going to go up through the second story. And we're gonna, we tried going through the front door, but it was hard to get through. So we're gonna try this way. Huh? 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 
There's another rock. Poor Billy. Push over rocks. honey. I'm going to go in then. Maybe I can help up there. Bad. If we hit that, it'll be bad. strapping. got a bit of a tricky turnaround here. This is Abby speaking, and I would just like to say a big thank you to my parents for this awesome lumber. Super excited to use it. Bush took a hit. That's okay. I didn't trim it when I was supposed to, so maybe that'll help. 
And also a huge thank you to London who helped unload and Jay, who you probably didn't see. A good job was done by all and a good time was not really had by all, but they were very, they were very heavy pieces of wood. Get in there. Get in there. So now we want to share our results of our contest on ladies' weights. And uh, I was very surprised, we both were very surprised at what she weighed. Like I said at the end of the last video, she weighed less than she did even on her last weighing. And it was considerably less. Because it was so much less, get a bill. That's why I wanted to give a few more um, uh, hints on the last video at the end of it. And uh, um, I honestly didn't think people would guess how much she, the correct weight. But we had, actually we had, what we, what we're hoping for is five winners. And we got five winners. We got five people that guessed the right amount of weight. There was a couple of people later on that guessed it, but what I'd said was the first five would, would win. And so I was very pleased when we did get five that guessed the correct weight. So let me hitch up Bill and we'll go out to the whiteboard and Brenda will show you the weights and tell you the winners. So I 
as you can see here, lady is 1839 on April 5th. So she did go down quite a bit. I was surprised how little she did weigh. But here are the winners. Deborah Anderson, Steve Adams, Ann Warnot, Mary A-Y-O-T-T-E, I, I would guess you say it, and Gary Lot Speech, L-O-T-S-P-E-I-C-H, just to make sure we get the right name there. But thank you so much for all of you people who were willing to write down and guess. We will get your hats out to you, so tell us if you wanted the, the black and gray hat or the tan and brown hat or the pink and white hat. How do they get hold of us to um, give us that information? Email us at workinghorseswithjim at yahoo.com and let us know your preference and your mailing address and we will ship those out to you. Just wanted to say also, we are going to have a couple more contests in, a few, in the next few weeks before Lady Foles. We would like to have a, a contest of guessing the, the date when she's going to fall. And then we're also gonna have a contest. We're not quite sure how we're gonna go about to do it, but we're gonna have a contest so you guys could help us choose the name of the foal of ladies. So I guess that's all we have for today. Yep. You guys have a great day. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.